Okay, so the thing about efforts to outcomes is that it really provides an opportunity to get a very deep understanding of what human services are all about. Uh, it's the only um, sophisticated software application that's web-based that really is designed uh, in its deep architecture to connect, uh, a to, to connect the relationship between what uh, activities staff are undertaking and what the results of their work are, and to understand um, not just whether or not people, uh, uh, clients or participants, achieve outcomes, but also what happens to them along the way on their path towards achieving outcomes. The other thing that's really special about uh, Efforts Outcomes is that it is extremely um, customizable to very, very unique uh, organizations using very different uh, service models uh, and has the capacity to trace movement in qualitative ways in a, in a participant's life uh, or even in the relationship between the participant and his or her case manager. And so you can actually trace stages in development of a relationship which is purely qualitative, but you can treat it um, in, a, in a way that uh, an evaluator would call using a Likert scale that's quantifiable. And so you can understand aggregate changes in client populations or participant populations over time. With um, the enterprise license and the other higher licenses, it's really possible to look uh, across organizations, not just across programs within one organization, but if organizations agree to participate in efforts to outcomes, if they are in a situation where they are providing a continuum of care, where clients actually um, use different services in different organizations, if and when these organizations can agree to utilize the same software without giving up their autonomy and their privacy, nonetheless, you can use ETO to create a seamless pathway among organizations, keeping track of the uh, person's progress and also of the person's new and emerging needs and make sure that um, the person is getting the appropriate services as they're needed and always understanding what these are contributing to the person's outcomes and ultimately to their ability to um, exit from services and, and go on uh, living productively.